My beef with the Newman family continues. So Papa Newman, Fugazi LeVar Ball, Persian Uncle, Danny DeVito with the clipboard, must have seen my latest masterpiece on TikTok and followed up with some very vital information. He sent this Friday at 4.06 in the morning, so clearly he's working while they sleep. Honestly, that's somewhat impressive. Would you like me to send you a list of players, all big names that actually reclass two or three times? No, of course I don't. Some of them are six to eight years older. That's 24 to 26 years old. Maybe Juana man. This ain't no straight to VHS movie. Come on now. I Bleach Your Report is the most watched baller on the planet on any level, including LeBron. What is the stat from? Unless we're talking about that meme clip of him dribbling OD fast. Then in that case, you got me there, brother. It says funny. Jesus got you, boy. Oh, does he ever. First of all, I already tried to tell you that I'm Jewish. Now, if you're talking about Moses splitting the seas and fucking dunking on my ass, you may have me there. Number one sports reality show on all platforms. I did some digging of my own. I googled number one sports reality shows. First up, overhauling. Y'all are getting beat by long haul truckers. How does it feel? America first, dog. And number three, we have gladiators. Number four, we have the ultimate fighter. I can't let you get close. And he sends me a 280 HP video. This looks like it was shot in 2002. A little pop-up shop of tweens fulfilling their wildest dreams. We got Chaz Brock and Michael Michaels rocking prodigy merch. This is exactly what you see when you enter the depths of hell. The first to his own brand, the first to his own show. First, first, first. Ball and the Family debuted in August of 2017. Hello Newman premiered in 2019. Disgusting. And he sends me a link to an article. It says Newman did put up 45 points in an 84 to 115 loss. Caring too much about individual accolades instead of the team priority, which is to win games. So y'all can't even get your own propaganda correctly. You just sent me an article that's directly bashing both of you. It says you do understand people only hate on him because he's five foot six, right? I thought he was five foot seven. At least he's honest about one thing. Oh, and never mind his own blog on USA Today. This might be the newest trash accolade I've ever heard. Y'all are bragging about a blog? A Zanga? Go get a diary. Write your thoughts down somewhere. If he's truly just defending his son while that is honorable, this dude is fucking crazy.